getting funding for internal improvements is a good way of, of downplaying some of the radicals among them uh, and making sure that uh, you know, there, there is no state out there getting too many uh, questions about self-determination in their own right. <laughs> yeah, when it comes to internal improvements, there's a tremendous amount of cronyism that's that's involved. I was always influenced. One of the first books I ever read was The Myth of the Robber Barons by Burton Folsom. And when he goes into how the government, transcontinental railroads, Union Pacific and Central Pacific in particular, were built, they were built uh, very poorly. They used the wrong materials. It was hastily done. There were these winding routes because they were trying to collect more money, et cetera, as opposed to James Hill's private Nor Great Northern. I was always very influenced by this argument, and I really try to show this in my own book, Cronyism, because, yeah, these, these, these constraints do affect government projects. Right. So the national road was you the, 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 it was built with costly materials. There were political appointees of people in charge of creating the road that shouldn't really have been in charge of this. But they were there because it was a patronage job. Uh, there were political considerations for the route of the road. And uh, Gallatin basically told Jefferson that, hey, you know, the road should go through uh, various towns because we need them for an election. I think in one case, one of them was Gall it was also Gallatin's hometown. So you know, a, a little bit of a little bit of cronies and personal personal sweetener there. And uh, yeah, that this is this is a huge issue because you see it throughout government uh, investment, so called investments. That this is uh, the the inevitable result. So. And, you know, we, we really pushed for uh, the, 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 the to keep New England in the union. We had the land speculation schemes of, of, of the Yazoo. We were trying to satisfy them or Jefferson is trying to placate them uh, that way. The the internal improvements is really to keep the West from from leaving. Right. And this is always the idea that you got to give them a sweetener. Right. If they're supposed to stay in the union. And this is this is this is a big issue. One other point I just want to mention uh, when we talk about various people, free market people, otherwise coming out in favor of internal improvements, uh, it is important to note that many laissez faire economists at this time had also made, an, unfortunately, in our opinion, they made exceptions, saying that, oh, well, under certain conditions, uh, the government can build roads like Adam Smith or other people, whether it's military necessity, like for national defense or just something else, et cetera. And Americans, they accentuated that. They, they, they thought, one, well, we can spend more money if we have all these fiscal surpluses uh, and if we want to keep the West in the Union or if it's underdeveloped, et cetera. But it ultimately came from um, the some of the, the the free market economists, the economic thought at this time, not really fully recognizing uh, the errors in their own logic. Ideas do have consequences in the policy realm. All right. And it's just important to uh, to, to note this. I, I remember reading one time Charles Sumner, a noted free trade, a noted free market Republican, uh, the later Republican Party, uh, actually had read John Baptiste say a treatise on uh, political economy. And he had uh, underlined the parts where say uh, had come out in favor of internal improvements. Right. <laughs> and so it's like it's an interesting uh, dynamic. So it's just important. Uh, to keep that in mind, Jefferson was anti-internal improvement. He recognized the corruption that it would cause, the political issues. He was familiar with free market thought. But once again, he acquiesced, uh, particularly when he realized that he had to keep, you know, he had all this land in Louisiana. They better start building uh, public works to connect the West with the East. Mm -hmm.